Alright guys, welcome back to another Wandering Wednesday. This is Jeremy Carr with Jeremy Carr's World Blog or on Instagram, Jeremy Carr's Studio. Today we're talking about the coronavirus, giving you some things of how like it's affected me and some tips on to keep it out of your life. A really cool thing about this video, I am linking down a fundraiser for the CDC so you all can you know, donate to that cause since the coronavirus is like really huge right now. So just donate to CDC, a Center Disease Control. You know, they uh, operate all that kind of stuff and keep these large diseases and viruses and bacteria or whatever all they do to keep us safe. So whatever you can donate, donate. I'm gonna make my contribution. And uh, one thing that I have never been able to learn is that card thing, like where, where it's like, and just like full, like it's like a bridge they call it. So I've never been able to do that. So we're gonna get, we're gonna try that. But yeah, if you can donate, you can donate. That's cool. Uh, if not, no big deal. This is hard times for everybody. So, all right, I will be able to get this. Oh, I almost had it though. All right, so we're just gonna we're just gonna try this. Oh, got it, got it. All right, well, let's get with that intro. Okay, so we made it here in downtown St. Louis. Like I said before, when I was doing the little bridge uh, trick, we are talking about the virus, Corona, COVID-19. It's COVID, right? So we're gonna be talking about that. Maybe like a little bit of my thoughts on it and stuff. Um, I don't know, nothing really too special on this. Ryan and I, we kind of hung out here today. We're doing some applied nudity with the arch because what better time? But uh, I kind of want to just start off with saying, uh, you know, like, like number one tip to avoid like the corona or just like literally any sickness, and I keep hearing this all the time, is wash your hands. So just wash your hands, folks. I mean, I think I was taught early on, like, I don't know, like at five years old or four years old to just wash your hands. I mean, I think I'm doing pretty good. I don't think I have it, but I might. But I don't think I do. But hey, whatever. So anyway, let's just kind of walk around St. Louis and see what we can find and see what we can get ourselves into. All right? Okay, so uh, as you can see, every bit of downtown St. Louis is literally closed because of the COVID-19 or the coronavirus. But uh, I thought this would be a good opportunity to just give you another tip. Um, but I think you need to stay six feet away from me because the coronavirus is like all like airborne and everything. So I don't need your sneezes and everything getting down on my germs, okay? Keep your germs to yourself.
what's up guys so i'm out here with jeremy he's helping me shoot some photos kind of doing his own vlog thing too and uh the reason why i'm wearing all these like baggy sweats and hoodies because when we do like these nude shoots in public either a blanket or like it's nice to wear really baggy shit so i can just kind of like drop it throw it on the ground hurry up get the shot it's needed and uh yeah that's typically how we get these kind of shots and uh, we're at this bridge right now there's absolutely nobody on the bridge it's really nice nobody's out and about today everybody's scared of the flu i mean uh coronavirus and uh yeah so that's it for me be free corona free you heard you heard it right brian's up here I was gonna drop you, didn't you? Did you breathe me in? Okay, so tip number three, that's gonna be do not share personal items. That means as like your cell phone or like your wallet of sorts. I don't want your cell phone, please keep it to yourself. Um, that's like top one of like most things that have germs. But as you can see, the metro just made it up here. Literally nobody here. I'm gonna get down here because the dude's coming. Because uh, it's just so dead. This coronavirus thing has just got it so dead. Uh, honestly, it really hasn't affected me that much, other than that there's no rush hour at 7 o'clock in the morning, so that's always nice. Uh, another thing is, is um, it's really unfortunate that I can't go to Walmart and just totally just buy a, a loaf of bread. Uh, kind of makes you think that, that you're grateful for, you know? Um, but anyway, uh, let's see what else we can get ourselves into. <laughs> As you can see, I'm just rolling through here, like through downtown and stuff. Like, there's just nothing going on. It's just a zombie town. It's just so weird. It's just such a weird life to live. Such a weird time to be living. Uh, but like, I mean, you know, like as as for getting sick and stuff, like it hasn't really affected me. The coronavirus and everything, like it hasn't really affected me. Honestly, over the whole thing, really for me, it's just been. It's just been humans. Humans actually really scare me the most. So I don't know. We'll see what we can. We'll see what we can do. I still got another tip. Uh, going up. You know, no big deal for me. It's just really crazy to see St. Louis so dead. Like, just everywhere. Behind me. It's just, it's just, this is just very strange. It's like, it's like literally like walking dead. Uh, hopefully it doesn't get to like the Resident Evil kind of stuff because phew, we're probably all dead. Um, but anyway, before I wrap this video up, as you can see, downtown is like super dead. We're not normally used to this kind of stuff. But uh, COVID-19, man. So uh, last tip before I go, stay in your house. I know I'm kind of doing a bad example of that because I'm out and about. Um, but I tell you what though, if you are out and about, uh, keep it, yeah, just, yeah, keep it six feet away. Um, but anyway, let's bring it in because let's get a little bit closer. But uh, in all, it hasn't really affected me too much. I can tell you what though, getting out of here in downtown in rush hour at was it like 3 34 o'clock that ain't gonna be a thing so it could always be worse right but uh anyway i'm gonna wrap this up happy wondering wednesday happy i don't even know what today's day i don't even know what today is what is it is it monday happy monday happy wondering wednesday jeremy carr jeremy carr studio on instagram please if you like this video hit it down in the comments let me know what you think uh See ya.